much. Here's my outfit for today. I'm wearing this My Melody hair clip. It has little rhinestones on it. Chanel earrings. This Hello Kitty angel necklace. And this um, a cardigan from... Well, not cardigan, but it's kind of like a cardigan. It's from Miss Lisa. And this little bow cami that I got from Sheen. And this skirt that is also from Sheen. And it has the cutest little details. And I'm also wearing this pearl bracelet. And my angelic pretty bag. I customized this bag. I put a little pearl string on it. Because I see that a lot of angelic pretty bags have that detail on them. And I felt like that it was missing it. And I'm also wearing this Charming Kitty ring. It's so cute. It has a little rose. Super cute. I set up a lot in my room since my last video, so I feel you guys can see in the background, it's very cute right now. But yeah, room tour is definitely coming soon. I'm almost done with my room. Update on the Nico package is not coming yet, so I really hope I don't miss it before I leave. You guys, my Nico package finally came! I'm so excited. I was literally waiting all day day for this package i'm not even kidding like i really thought it wasn't gonna come like usually they deliver it really early in the day oh my god i'm so excited okay i now understand why the shipping was so expensive this time like it's so heavy i also got two different packages so we're going to unbox that as well oh by the way if you don't know what nikyo is nikyo is a japan proxy site where you can buy secondhand clothing and you guys know this about me like i love my Nikyo hauls. It's just so fun finding like really unique stuff on there and like stuff that isn't really produced anymore. You can really find a lot of rare stuff that is hard to find in the US. Like when I shop on Nikyo, like I'm searching on there and I'm clicking through every single page just to make sure I find what I want. Because sometimes I'll see things that I saved on Pinterest. Like I saved this My Melody bag and I found her and there's some stuff like that in here as well but yeah let me stop talking and just like get into it because I've been waiting for this all day but like being late to the lip filler appointment really put me in a mood so I'm hoping that this will cheer me up but yeah let's start with the Nikyo haul I'm gonna use my Hello Kitty box cutter I wish I could lift this up and open it for you guys but it's like literally 6,000 pounds Oh, by the way, there's a doll included in this haul, so I'm gonna reveal it at the end, but yeah, keep watching till the end, I swear, it's so cute. I'm just gonna go ahead and like pull what I see first. First item, oh my god, first item is this Charming Kitty bag. Look at how cute it is, it has a little bow right here, and it has all of her cute things like this box, this necklace, this key, this perfume. I'm literally screaming. Oh my god. Okay. <gasps> so cute. I'm just like gagged. This is so cute. But yeah, first item. Oh, okay. Okay, so this is actually a bundle item. Like the seller sent me a bunch of stuff. She was selling like a whole collection of Hello Kitty stuff and this is all it comes in. This is such a cute box. Zebra print with hot pink and this hot pink bow. Like, this is so Y2K. Okay, let's open her. There was a specific item that made me really want to buy it from her. Oh, she sent me a little thank you card. First thing that I see is this Hello Kitty, like, ID holder, I think. Oh my god, it's so sparkly. Cute. I'll probably attach this to like a bag or something. And then next is this. Oh my god, this is so cute. Okay, this is a little floral mirror. And this is the little pouch that it comes in. Look at her. Oh, this is so cute. <gasps> okay, we have a little cunty little Hello Kitty devil. Perfect for October. Oh my god. Okay, this is literally what I wanted from this whole entire purchase. This little Hello Kitty pillowcase. Oh my god. 
I love the black bow with the hot pink jewel right there. I think it's really cunty. And yeah, you can put anything you want in here. But yeah, super cute. I'm probably just gonna keep this in my bag. Also came with this Hello Kitty. Um, I don't know what to put in here. I think it's like you put Q-tips in here. Oh, did I just break it? Oh, okay, you twist it. You don't just like snap it open, like what? And then it also has this wipe container. I have a My Melody one in my bathroom, so I'm probably gonna keep one in my room as well. So, very cute. And yeah, that's all in this one. Okay, oh my god. Okay, next I got these My Melody rhinestone hair clips. They're so adorable. I saw these on Pinterest and they are literally so cute. Oh my god, they're so sparkly. Oh my god, so cute. I only have these two right now. So you can add her to the collection. Cute. Oh my god. Okay, next I got this keychain. I tried to buy this on Amazon Japan because that's where you can get the newer Sanrio collections, but they literally sold out so quick. So I found her on Yukio. And look at how cute she is. She's like a little angel. I really want to get more from this line. Like I want the plushie. I think the plushie is so cute. Okay, next I got another keychain. Oh, this one's so cute. So it's a little Hello Kitty key. She has a little crown and a little pink rhinestone on her bow. So cute. I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, but whatever, it's still really cute. You guys. Okay, so I got two of my Melody plushies that came in a set. And I literally see these all over Pinterest and I've been wanting to get one of these from this line. I feel like this line is so rare to come by. And the fact that I have two, like, period. I have this jumbo sized one. She's so cute. Look at her bow. It's like polka dots. And her fur is so cute. It's like kind of swirly. Oh my god, I love her. I don't think I would have lived if I did not have her. Like, she's an essential. Oh my god, she's so cute. The small one is just as cute as well. Okay, so the seller that gave me this, I forgot that it came with a whole ass suitcase. Um, like what? I'm not really that big of a fan of this type of red. Um, oh, there's something else in here. Oh my god, it's a scarf. This is actually really cute. But again, I'm not really a red type of girl. Oh my god, wait, this is so cute. <gasps> this tote bag. Oh my god, it's so cute. It's like pink gingham. And if she has a little flower. <gasps> cute. And then there's this thing in here. I don't know what this is. Wait a minute. Oh my god. I was not expecting this. I saw this in the photo, but I had no idea what it was. This is really cute. Oh my, she's a little dirty though. But maybe I can like rhinestone that or something. I don't know. Oh my god, this is so cute. Wait. <gasps> Shut up. Oh my gosh. This is like a future DIY project in the making. Okay. Uh, I just love when a Nikki haul surprises me. Like, it just gives me like a really certain boost of serotonin. Okay, next. I got, oh my god, this is probably why it weighs so much. I got a bunch of these magazines. The seller was selling like a whole bundle of them for like 10 bucks. So yeah, you know I snatched that shit up real quick. Okay, I need to count how much I actually bought it because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. I bought 13 magazines. But yeah, it's these Ageha. I'm so sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. But yeah, here's the first one. 
I just love looking at these magazines for like inspiration. They have so much cute stuff in here. And sometimes if I find a really cute page, I'll like cut it and put it on my wall. As you can see, I have some over here. But yeah, I'm probably gonna put more all over my room. Cause I just think that editing in these magazines, like they really amp up the girliness and the sparkles and the bows and the pink. Here's the second one, the third one. Fourth one, fifth one. I really love this one actually. This one, her motorcycle has like glitter and bows on it. And this is just everything. And then I got this one, super cute. I love the pink eyeshadow and all the sparkles and pink, super adored. And then this one, this one, and then this Halloween one, this one. This one's the last one. Okay, now it's time for clothes. First item is this Juicy Couture wallet. She's gray and pink. Oh, I don't really have a gray Juicy bag though. I think the gray and pink combo is so cute though. But yeah, cute. Okay, next item is from Lisa, and I got a pair of glasses. It comes in this really cute case. It has black lace on it and a pink background. Oh my god, cute. I got these kind of Bayonetta Tommy February 6 type of glasses. These are like really trendy right now and I honestly think they're really cunt. They have a little heart on the side and they're like a pink shade. Let's try them on. Oh my god, they're so adorable. I have a pair of sheen ones, but these definitely are better quality. And it also comes with a little wipe. Okay, next I got this angelic pretty bow. It's like this pretty light pink shade and it has these pink rhinestones scattered and this really pretty lace. I'm probably gonna wear this on the back of my head. I really want more angelic pretty stuff, but their stuff is so expensive on Nikkyo. Like this little bow was literally $16, which isn't terrible, I guess. But still, their stuff is so expensive. I definitely want more of their dresses, but their dresses are like $200. So yeah, I have one dress from angelic pretty that I really love. It's kind of like this apron dress with a heart in the middle. It's so adorable. I haven't worn it yet. Okay, next are these shoes. I actually screamed when I found these shoes because I have been searching for shoes like this on Nikkyo for like forever. Like they're so rare and they're so adorable. Like they're literally so perfect. This is the front of them. This is from the brand Jesus Diamante. And they have this cute little crown that I think is like removable. I actually don't think you can remove this one. And it has lace and it's like this meal type of style. And it has a huge bow in the back. They're so adorable. I'm really scared to try these on because they look so tiny. I'm a size eight in heels. And Japan sizing, when it comes to heels, it's either a small, medium, or large. I feel like I can squeeze into a medium or a large, but a small? I don't know about that. Oh shit, they literally don't fit. I'm actually so upset. Oh my god. But they're so cute. Oh my god. Well. Now what? Wow, I don't know how to feel, like, they're mine, but I can't fit into them, like... Whatever. Okay, now we're gonna get into, like, the clothes clothes, like, long sleeves and stuff like that, so... Yeah. Just a warning, I got a bunch of juicy long sleeves, like, I've been collecting them. So the first juicy long sleeve that I got is this one. It has this cute pink bow, and it says, Choose Juicy really cute i'm like obsessed with juicy long sleeves right now i feel like they're gonna be like an everyday staple and my wardrobe is upcoming 
winter. And then I got this one. It says bundle up, wear juicy. And it's the same silhouette, long sleeve. And this really cute, warm pink color. It's a little peachy. I'm not really into peach like that. And then I got this juicy sweater. It says juicy spa on it. And it has cute little rhinestones. And it's like backless and you can tie it like that. And then this long sleeve, it has this cute crown detail on it. Oh my God, it's so sparkly. Wow, this one is really pretty. It's kind of like this cream color. And I really love this light pink and it has like a little silver. Wow, I really love this one. And then this one says choose juicy and the juicy is like rhinestones and it has the silver lettering and this really cute baby pink. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is the last juicy long sleeve. I got this one. It says Juicy Heiress and the letters are like rhinestones. Oh, this is cunty. Okay, next I got two mezzo piano tops. So this is the first one and it has the cutest detailing on here. And this pink is literally so perfect. And I'm like obsessed with the sleeves. Like I just see so many cute looks with this. Oh my God, she's like, Gorge, obsessed with Mezzo Piano. They have like the cutest details on their shirts ever. Okay, next I got this Mezzo Piano top and it has tiara, rhinestones. Oh my God, it's so cute. And this rhinestones um, crown right here. Oh my God, it's so cute. I love the sleeves. Wow, this is adorable. Okay, we're gonna move on to Liz Lisa now. I haven't been finding a lot of Liz Lisa stuff, but I did find this floral dress. It's this really cute floral pattern and it has this pink silk bow in the middle. It looks a little big, but I think it'll fit cute. I think, I don't know. And then next I got this cute cami from Liz Lisa and it's like polka dots and it has this cute lace trimming with this little bow right here. And the back has this cute little cross lace detail. It'll probably look better when you wear it, but. Okay, this is the last top. It's this cute little camisole and it has rhinestone straps and this really cute pink polka dot with this hot pink ribbon is so kind, like, this is giving me like Mars. This isn't from Mars. I don't really know what this brand is. It doesn't say, but that's kind of what it's giving. I love black and hot pink. Like I think it's such a hot combo. Okay, now it's time for the doll. I only ever buy dolls if it's like really rare. And if I really want it, guess who she is? Like. She's really cunty. Okay, reveal in three, two, one. I got the pull up Hello Kitty doll. She's a lot bigger than I thought. I was not expecting her to be so big, but I'm really happy she is. Like she was really worth every penny. I only paid like a hundred for her, which I feel like is very cheap compared to the prices that I've seen online. So I'm really lucky that I got her in the box, new, untouched. And she comes in the cutest box ever. Like I love the lace. And I chose the most perfect pink ever. Here's the side of it. Here's the back of it. That's her little outfit. And here's the other side. And yeah, super cute. But yeah, she has her little shoes right there, her gloves. And you can get a little close-up of her mug. She has pink eyeshadow and blonde curls and this cute headpiece with this pink lace bow right here. And her dress is literally everything. It has this pink lace with the bows and the heart. And yeah, she's so cute. As much as I 
want to unbox her. I'm gonna keep her in the box because she's special. I really want to unbox her though. Like I'm so tempted. Should I do it, you guys? <gasps> this is all I'm gonna unbox. Like, oh my god, she's so pretty. This is my first ever pull-up doll. And I think that's really kind that I got the Hello Kitty one for my first one. Okay, back in the box you go. Okay, that's all for my Nikyo haul. Okay, let's move on to this package. Okay, this is the Sheen order. The first thing that I'm seeing is this box and I'm guessing it's shoes. <gasps> Ooh. I'm gonna like put lace all over here and like a big bow because I was kind of scared that this wasn't gonna fit and I was literally right. So I'm just gonna DIY it and like put lace and a bow on it. I also got these clear ones like forever ago that I've been wanting to DIY. So yeah, I have two projects to work on now. I just love a pleaser. Like I feel like they look so good in photos. Like they look like little doll shoes. I also got these bows to put on the pleasers. Like, I think you guys see the vision. Like, you know, a little moment, if you will. And then I also got these roses for DIY projects. I've been really into like Haim, Hime, Gyaru styles recently. And they always include like bows, lace, and like these little roses. Okay, haul is over. That was literally so much. And I literally have another Nikyo package for you guys. Like, if you thought this one was good, the next one is even better, I think. So, okay, that's everything in there. Let's see if it applies. Okay, I think I got it. Oh my god, yay! Everything fit! Okay, now I need to organize all of these magazines. I keep all my magazines and books in this Hello Kitty thing. Okay, wow, everything literally fit. I'm shocked, but... Really happy that I did that. Oh, it's so heavy. I also got McDonald's. I have my hot glue gun. I'm gonna go ahead and let this heat up. Let's choose out what we want to use. I definitely want to use these bows. So I'm gonna get two of those. I'm gonna edit the bows a bit because they have these little bows on the side right here and I don't really like that yellow. So I'm gonna cut it off. Well, actually, I'm just gonna rip it off because it's stuck with hot glue, I think. And then there's this little clip right here that I'm gonna try to remove. It's pretty easy, like the sheen stuff, like they just hot glue everything. Period. I can probably save this and like make my own hair clip. Yay, we have our own little bow now. Okay, the hot glue gun is ready. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on so that we have a little base to work through. I think it covers the whole entire front part of the heel. So, wow, that's so cute. I already see the vision. Like, I'm gonna start here and add a little bit of glue. Okay, now I'm going to add a strip right here. I'm gonna add a bit right here as well. This is my first time working with the shoe, you guys, so... I'm really scared that I'm not doing this right. But I think I am, honestly. Okay, this is kind of turning out, period. Okay, now that we have our little base going on we can like really go in with the details now okay so i'm like conflicted between whether i should do a rose a pink heart gem or this like white heart gem 
I'm kind of leaning towards the rose. I think it's really pretty with the rose. And it really gives what I'm trying to go for. Yep, we're gonna go for the rose. I can probably use these heart ones on the clear ones. But for this shoe, I think the rose fits really well. And then I'm just gonna stick it on there. And hold it. So far, this is how it's turning out. Oh my god, it's so cute. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with rhinestones. Okay, I added the rhinestones and I did that. Like, I really did that. Okay, now I'm gonna add a bow, like this one. I'm gonna use the same bow, but I'm gonna like cut this layer off and just keep it this with no pearls. I'm gonna put it behind there. Okay, I'm gonna add the bow now. And period. Look at how I ate that. La Pafe, eat your heart out. Like, why to kind of eat her up though? I can't wait to do a photo shoot with these. Like, these are so gaggy. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna do the other shoe off camera. But yeah, I ate the fuck. Okay, I finished them. They are literally so perfect. They came out exactly how I wanted them. Actually, it turned out way better than I thought, honestly. And I'm literally so happy. Oh my god. I'm so proud of myself. Like, but yeah, I'll wear these on Instagram eventually. So follow me on there. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I have another Mikio haul in the works right now. So expect that very soon. I'm also going to be vlogging a trip that I'm gonna be going on soon so yeah I'm gonna try to be more consistent I know that I only post like literally once a month at this point I'm so sorry please check out my other videos subscribe like and comment follow all of my socials and until next time bye dolls